In this clip, we explain the different file types available working with Roadmaker. The file types covered. The first five we use in the single line design and the last three in the road network design. For the single line design, the generating of the PID, XX1 and GRO files start in Model Maker. To add the horizontal alignment, horizontal left main menu and new at the bottom menu, use one of the three methods to add a alignment. I add a horizontal alignment using a existing CAD line. Using selecting a polyline will track the line and add the alignment using the existing curve radiuses on each curve. Once finished, save it as a .pid file at the bottom menu. Next, with the survey data already loaded, we extract the cross sections with a .xx1 file extension. Go to Sections left menu and bottom menu cross sections. We use the horizontal alignment from above and extract cross sections perpendicular at a specific width from the alignment at a specified chainage interval. Save the xx1 file with the same name as the .pid file. Next extract a long section file .gro. The long section is additional and not necessary if the survey is flat. Save the long section file as a .gro file with the same name as the above .pid and .xx1 files. The PR3 file is the design file for Roadmaker. Once we loaded the above three files in Roadmaker, we create a cross section profile and long section vertical alignment design and save that as a .pr3 file with the same name as the others to keep them grouped together. The .ral Roadmaker All file is similar to the .mol file Modelmaker All. Use File Save All or File Open All. The file contains all the data loaded into Roadmaker upon saving the file. This can include up to 8.xx1 groups, 8.gro groups, the PID file and the PR3 design file. Road Network Design To start the network design, we start in Model Maker again. The network design uses an alignment string.kcs file for the horizontal alignments plan layout and a .bot file of the triangulated DTM data. Start by adding the layout with alignment strings and save the string as a .kcs file.
For the survey data, make sure that the survey covers all the strings in the plan layout, wide enough on each side of the string to extract sections at the road width you require. Save the survey data as a .bot file. To open the network files in Roadmaker, we have two options. Send the data with the Send Receive toolbar. Send both the strings and the DTM. Make sure both programs are open before you start. The alignment strings in Roadmaker, go to File, Import, MM Strings, Roads. Once you select your file, then the next prompt will be to open the relevant .bot file. Select the file and open it. Next, activate the road to do the design and save the network file .mmr. We also have a .prd file that you can save a single road cross-section design and when you activate a new road you do not need to do the design again but load it as a profile pattern. If you want to open the network again you would just go File, Load Road Network and select the .mmr file and open it. Roadmaker will remember where the .bot file was saved and automatically load that in the background. That's it for our Roadmaker file types. Have a look at some of our other clips and subscribe not to miss out on any new clips.